Hi guys! Alright, so I figured we'd do a quick video on what to do or what not to do if you're with me when I start having a seizure. Um, and this is going to be different for everybody. Everybody has their own preferences or their own needs when they have a seizure. So this is just for me, what I need, what I like when I'm about to have one. So here we go. Um, I usually have like a one to two minute window when I know it's about to happen. Uh, so I can give you a heads up. <laughs> um, and so what I'll probably do is call Danny, my husband Danny on my phone and just throw it to you so he can kind of walk you through it. And uh, like, hey, I'm about to have a seizure. Uh, here's Danny just in case. Uh, so even if you don't get him, even if we don't get him on the phone, it's still going to be the same. I'm going to say... Um, all right, so I'm seeing a light aura right now. I'm about to lose vision in my right eye. Um, it's going to be okay. Do not call an ambulance. <laughs> Only reason you should ever call an ambulance is if I'm actively bleeding, which I'll come with, that has never happened, or my seizure lasts longer than five minutes, which I'll come with, that has never happened. Um, so should not need to call an ambulance. We haven't yet. Um, <clears throat> so don't call an ambulance, stay calm. It's not going to be a big deal. I'm just going to, um, convulse for a little bit and then it'll take me about 20 to 30 minutes to become aware again, to be able to converse with you and remember what I'm talking about, what I'm saying, <laughs> to maybe make sense. Um, but it'll be okay. Uh, so then I will, if we're in my house, I will come here, this this is my seizure spot. This is where I come. I will come right here, I will sit down, I will grab this, and I will lean back and relax. Because if I'm leaning back, I can flail about this way and not hurt myself, not fall over. And I will just take deep breaths and just wait for it to be over and be okay. Um, if I'm out about anywhere and it starts to happen, I will find a spot where um, I can be out of the way, hidden about, and lay down on my side. Um, and gosh, I think postictally or whatever, um, after that happens, it's called postictal, um, I can get up and walk around. So I, I don't need to be hidden away for that long. <laughs> and usually I apparently want to get up, walk around, and go find a bathroom because I have yet to... Uh, go to the bathroom on myself, I want to find a bathroom right away, which in that case, just kind of guide me towards there. I don't need any help. I just need to know where one is and go. And that is fine. Um, uh, yeah, so um, I'll just need to find a spot to lay down on my side. I don't need help. I for sure don't want anybody touching me, rubbing me, caressing me, saying it's going to be okay. I, I'm not a touchy-feely person in general. I for sure am not when I'm having a seizure. I appreciate the sentiment. Uh, Danny's my person, my love, my husband, my everything. Most I want from him is a handhold. Even then, sometimes it's too much. So yeah, me personally, don't want touch, love, caress, anything like that. Just give me my space. Let me do what I need to do and we'll be okay. Um, so there's that and then I'll come back around and, uh, be okay. It's, it's, it can be <laughs> traumatic or just freaky if you've never seen it. And, uh, but then, you know, after a couple times you're like, oh, okay. Yeah. You're going to do that. And you're going to be <laughs> kind of, uh, kind of silly or, uh, not annoying, but maybe it is annoying. I don't know when I'm post -tictal. I'm not making any sense and not understanding. And you have to keep repeating yourself until I come back around. And I'm like, did I just have a seizure? What just happened? And you're like, yes, this is the third time I'm telling you. You have a seizure. Oh, well, whatever. But yeah, so that's what I need, what I want when I have a seizure. I just want to get to my little space, not be bothered too much. And just, uh, my main thing is I want to be able to get up and walk and go to the bathroom when I have 
people trying to hold me down or keep me uh, restrained, which I understand some people do need that. Some people get violent after or fall, hurt themselves to themselves. And it's hard to know which way somebody's gonna go if it's somebody you don't know. I get that. Uh, so that's why if it's somebody that's gonna be around me quite often, I would like them to know I am not that person. <laughs> I need to get up, walk to a bathroom. <laughs> that's my only need. So what about you guys? Anybody watching, comment down below. Let me know what do you need or does anybody do anything that annoys you uh, during, before, or after <laughs> your seizure that you wish you could just say, for the love of God, please stop or don't do that ever again. Uh, yeah, let me know. Curious. And uh, like, comment, subscribe. See you next time. Bye.